After Mozan's Infinity Castle gets destroyed, everyone gets sent out onto the city streets, and the first three to engage with Mozan are Mitsuri, Obunai, and Giyu, who have to deal with an enraged Mozan that sprouts eight tentacles from his back with sharp ends as he screams, so you plan on keeping me here until the sunrise? Go right ahead if you can. And as he says this, his whipping arms send Getsuga Tensho like waves of blood at the Hashira, who all make their way through the attack to reach the Demon King. We see love breathing, serpent breathing, and water breathing used in combination, but even though they manage to cut Muzan, Obanai watches as his sword passes through Muzan, and the injury is literally healed before his sword even leaves Muzan's body, making it seem like his attack just passed right through. It's here where they realize just how scary Muzan is, because his head is in his weak point, and his healing is so good that you can't really dice him up either. But in that time of thinking, Muzan lets out a massive attack that takes out a huge group of demon slayers that sacrifice themselves for the Hashira.